Asiata Group Berhad is expecting its Malaysian and Indonesian units to support its earning recovery in the second half ending December 31, 2015. Its group CEO, Datuk Sri Jamaluddin Ibrahim, says Selkom Asiata Malaysia and Excel Asiata Indonesia will be the group's engine of growth. He says group is also carrying out two to three dozens of initiatives to win back the confidence of its dealers and distributors. We have about two to three dozen initiatives already underway, very specific initiatives to recover and we are on track. There are some uh, good signs, but uh, I must say that you know we need to have more good signs for me to say categorically it will be all right. But I can say that we are confident that second half should be a better second half than the first half. The group is also resolving system-related issues which has impacted the earnings last year. Uh, the other one is in the pricing. I think uh, in a way related to the problem, but mostly nothing to do with the problem we have is our some of packaging is maybe uh, we have to improve our comp competitiveness and you all know about data pricing i think that those are the ones that we're working on we have already launched uh, three already prepaid ones postpaid and recently another one postpaid uh, there'll be a lot more announcements on uh, pricing he was speaking after the telecommunication company's agm today Yesterday, Asiata announced a fall of some 13% in its net profit for the first quarter 2015. Revenue increased from 4.75 billion ringgit from 4.51 billion ringgit. Asiata's share fell 3 cent to 6.72 ringgit for a market capitalization of 57.79 billion ringgit. Ashini Selvam, DHTV.